Hello, and welcome back to Blind Dark Souls 2. Last time, we... We went to a new area. A scary area. However, since then, in the day since then, I, uh, I did a little co-op to get a few more souls to buy some things. Over here, I did the, uh, I did the old Dragon Slayer co-op. And I got... A thing from it was this right here so it's cool apparently you can heal the master of worlds using this interesting but I'm gonna spoil uh, fuck it I, I, I read something online about how to do the blue sentinels transient being you have obtained proof you are worthy of joining our order. You may call yourself one of us, and are free to plant your roots in this garden of the gods. Be proud. I, Targre, do proclaim from this day, you are a Knight of the Blue. Rejoice, and bask in your new honor. You are no longer a mere vagabond. You are now a guardian, a knight of the blue. Proud knight, take this. Wear this ring and shine light upon stone. Then you will hear the voices of the blue apostles. Listen for their cries of help and repel the malicious invaders. This is the proud work of the Knights of the Blue, the way they elevate themselves to a higher plane. I'll provide what you need. You may visit me at any time. Proud Knight, you may come to me, Targre, for help. There we go. No, oh, buy items, huh? Alright, so that's his halberd, I guess. No, oh, no, it's just a halberd. Morning star. Alright, what else cool do you have? Pure poison, restore HP. Not bad. Oh, what are these other things? Hmm. Hmm? That's weird. Oh! Yes! So this is, uh, this is, I guess, what you can use to upgrade stuff to lightning. Mm-hmm. Yep. Perfect. You know what? This is more or less my intention anyway. I'm going to buy these. I know I can't really use them, so that may be seen as dumb. Also, I guess I'll buy some of these just to see. Um, but you know, I'm probably going to end up using this character to get the uh, trophies. So, got to buy whatever miracles I can find. Oh, proper bow. We Knights of the Blue must rely upon one another to achieve our greater goal. Present your token of fidelity. To test your strength against other Knights. Proud Knight, aim high in all things. We Knights must protect the Apostles of Blue. Never forget this fact, and by your honor, never eschew your training. There are others in this forsaken place who have only a lust for blood. 
they conspire to ambush blue apostles on the road. Knight of the Blue, protect our apostles from these bloodthirsty brigands. Take pride in your duty as a blue knight. Work hard and pursue a higher plane. Do your work and I will lend you strength. Hmm. So, as a proper knight of the blue that we are now, <laughs> all of a sudden, let's put on our guardian seal and, you know, see what happens. But that's it. You know, I found out how to get... Oh, let's check out the new gesture as soon as I get down here. Uh, I found out how to get into that covenant, so I'm like, eh, show that on video. Alright, um, let's just replace bow with dual bow. Oh, so much better. Yes. Yeah, as you can see, my, um, my soapstone is on my taskbar. So that's what I was doing. Uh, there's nothing for us in Majula right now. We took... Oh, no. There is one thing in Majula for us. So let's hop over there very, very fast. And then we're going to head back to... Um... I don't even remember what it was called. That sort of... For lack of any other better description, that place that looks like the Forsaken Fortress from Wind Waker, almost. I guess. Oh, you know what? While we're in Majula, I actually know of a thing. One other thing that we can do. So we got two things to do in Majula. First things first. Uh, what's his face? The merchant did talk about Mr. Man up here quite a bit. So let's see if he has anything new to say. Maybe something about this guy will have changed, maybe? Who knows? I know I want to check. I like this guy. And his sword. Hey, buddy, I want your sword. Did I start you? Nope. Guess me, that release. Okay. So, last thing to do? I'm pretty sure... I finally found everything in Things Betwixt. But we have to take one last trip there in order to, you know, go over those things. Oh, you know what? Yeah. I can now wield my bow. So, I can also go kill that ogre. All the ogres. Let's just go murder the ogres. The, the main reason I want to murder the ogres is because I actually now know something about one of them. And that he may drop something. Pretty cool. Though knowing me, I'm going to be dumb and leave the extra souls ring on. Oh no, I spelled it. Spoiled it. It's a ring. Okay. Switch over to the other guy, please. This may seem cheap, but honestly, these guys are just the rudest. Seems like I do less damage sometimes with the arrows. If you expend your stamina, do you do less damage? That may very possibly be it. It's for 
killing me the first time I played this game. You big jerks. Who needs magic when I have bows? You know, this is a this might be a little boring for you guys, so I'll fight the last one. Ooh. Legit. Alright. So. See this coffin? I'm not gonna do it because I'm just gonna undo it anyway. No, oh, you can actually walk out here? Uh, I'm just gonna undo it anyway and, you know, a loading screen happens in between. The weirdest thing, if you jump in this coffin, it changes your gender. Yeah. And it's hidden behind two really hard to kill guys, so Dark Souls, you know. That's all I can really say. The, the annoying thing is like it changes your gender, but apparently it doesn't change your face. So if you start with like the preset male face or whatever and then you switch your gender, you, you now have male face and female body. And it just, it looks weird. It just, it, it just looks a little odd. Okay. So, oh, that was almost bad. So, all the way over here. Back where the, the dogs were. By the way, these dogs, you kill them all, you don't get anything. Like I originally thought. Yeah, over here there's another rusted coin. If you remember, those are the things that up your luck. Briefly. I guess nice if you're trying to farm something in particular. Alright. It's time to fight biggest man. I like how these first episodes of the night that I record now are just kind of becoming uh, housekeeping episodes. Like, here's the cool stuff I found when I was editing together the videos last night. Hmm. Biggest man is still very strong. Oh no! Oh come on! Uh, I wouldn't have thought that last hit would kill him. That's mm, biggest man. I'm gonna cut right here. Be right back. There, I killed him. <laughs> he drops a stone ring. Let me see if I can't work this in. I, sh I should just get rid of the covetous silver ring. Um, eh, I'm not going to worry about it too much. But yeah, reduces enemy poise. So it's good for staggering. It's probably going to be a big PvP ring. Just because poise is always a big deal in PvP, so. Yeah. Or it'll be like. I don't know. It's gonna, PvP is gonna be weird this time around. Even weirder than it was in Original Souls and other Souls and Man Souls. Ah, what is this called? The Lost. Bastilla? Bas... Bastil? Bastille? Hmm... <laughs> Words. Oh man, Titanite slabs still exist. Ugh, I hate Titanite slabs. 
Oh, wow. That loaded in real fast. Okay. Last time we were here, we ran like babies. Let's try and... accomplish something this time around. Can I backstab these guys? Why even bother? Oh, you know what? Yeah, I'll have to show that off in a later bit. She's gone. Huh. Well, that's not frightening at all. Man, you, you gotta work on your swings. You're just missing me every time. Y you and your um, doppelgangers, I guess. That way or this way? Let's go this way. Just roll through everything. Locked. Five bucks says. Nope, nope. Hello. Oh, sword mans. Oh, oh boy. Let's see if I can't stun them a bit better. Okay, original sword. Alright, they're slow though. These guys are really slow. Too, too bad. One heal for five guys, though. Common fruit. Uh, here we go. Boosts poison resist. Why does that scare me so m Oh, boy. Be wary of right. Easy peasy. Hmm. Hmm. Double hmm. The, dr the dreaded double hmm. Oh boy. Hi, right, buddy. Saw your friend. Okay. So, these barrels, I want to show something. I think I kind of showed this off last episode. But just to really show it off. Firebombs. So, any black barrels explode. Now, something more interesting, and I hope I can... I, I'll just explain it. When I was in the forest, I found some of these, and I attacked them with my fire sword, and that's how I found out that they exploded. And... They opened up a shortcut. Just, I got this. Oh, come on. You know, it's going to take a bit, but there we go. We'll do that one a little bit. Nope. Also, nope. Also, nope. Aha! Hmm. I mean, better life gems are better life gems. Speaking of life gems, why am I not using them instead of my flasks? This feels bossy, so. Hey, buddy. Alright, let's down the ladder. Oh, 
Oh, this just goes back the... The other way, I guess you could have come in here. Roll through all pots. Pots hold secrets. Wow! 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 <laughs> That's so rude! That is so rude! Oh, I want, I want in there. And then this is the way I came out. Right? Yeah. And I don't think I can get back across this ledge. So, the only way for us to go is through that fog gate. Well, I like having bosses in at least one of these sessions, so... Oh, here's another thing. You can break these with a sword normally, so... If you're worried about stuff exploding. Oh, this is so a boss. Um... Hello? Ruined Sentinels? Well, it's just one-on-one -on -one for now, so... It's like Don Quixote. Or I guess, uh... Have you ever played Castella Mol Mol Molina? I think it's... Mostly. Or something like that. It's a, it's a free-to-play, not free-to-play, it's a free game. It's really good, it's sort of like Ghouls and Ghosts. Uh, these guys remind me of a boss in that called Crazy Kyote. He's just a very lanky knight. Oh, um, huh. Oh, and then I aggro the other two. At the same time. Interesting. Do I have to fall down? Okay. Well then. <laughs> Let's make another cut here. Hey, we're back. Um, I wanted to check this pathway really quick before I continued and uh, tried to kill that boss. So. I mean, I see dogs here. I see items. Items could help. These guys, yeah, they just dropped uh, Nameless Souls. And that was the thing I saw out of earlier. Oh, Gold Pine Resin. Oh, you know what? Would you believe I actually still missed an item and things betwixt? There's a gold pine resin hidden uh, somewhere. Oh. Huh. <laughs> you know what? That. Those. Oh, I used my flask again instead of just life gems. Let's put those weapon buff items on my bar. That way, I can maybe... Oh, of course it's locked. Oh, hello! I don't know why this matters, but... Oh, McDuff's workshop. Oh, hey, big man! You know, I'm gonna raid your shop first. That looks drunk. Yeah. Titanite shards. We can use to upgrade some stuff. Maybe this guy upgrades. Iron arrows. Hmm. I wonder if those do more damage. Two shards! I can upgrade my broadsword again! I actually just remembered. Let's put those other... Arrows on my bar. Oh, those are bolts. Okay.
<laughs> I guess this is a trick to get to him early. Anyway, let's see what's up with him. <laughs> oh, why can't they all be this easy? It's a wild one here. Shape up. Shape up, I say. Oh, <laughs> that's it, yes. That's the way. Dear flame, how brightly you burn. <laughs> I ought to fetch a new ember. Flame, dear flame. I ought to fetch a new ember. Alright, that was weird. Hmm. No, I bet you I can make it back. And have one more attempt at that boss. Before we're done. These guys are chumps. Heal up. Attempt boss. I don't know... Uh, I, I hate bosses. Like, two-on-one bosses. Oh, wow. You know what? Let's just cut back when we're at the boss. Alright. Here we are again. Just ruined Sentinels. Let's go. They're not especially difficult. On top of that, I deal a lot of damage. Alright. Well, I guess I gotta go down. big fan of forcing me to take damage. Oh my god, what? Okay, maybe going down isn't a good idea. I should probably stay up there and try and kill one. Alright. Um... Yeah, see that move. Alright, we gotta get away, we need to heal. Wow, one of them throws his shield. But now does he not have a shield? Hmm, maybe this is the strategy. Nope, that's 40 damage. This fight is crazy dumb. They're all getting rid of their shields. Hey guys, we thought maybe Ornstein and Smo was too easy. So they only come one at a time. Scratch that. They come at you whenever the fuck they want to. Yeah. Hmm. This is a rough boss. <sighs> strategies, strategies. Well, the simplest strategy is you need. We, we're going to need to take out that one guy when he's up on the platform. And that goes without saying. Uh, we can't be fighting all three of them at once. 
one of them jumped up and he knocked me off. But he may be the only one that comes up. Nonetheless, my timer just went off. So that's it for this episode. Uh, we'll try and take them out next time. But this is a rough, rough boss. Also, yeah, look, look, look. that guy's wearing the Elite Knight set. So that is just straight up the Elite Knight set that that one guy sells. All right. I'll see you next time.